What's up, guys? Welcome back to Rob Squad Reactions with your boy Jay and your girl Amber. We are back today with another awesome suggestion by you guys, our amazing subscribers. Guys, today was a completely random, just random shot in the dark. We went down the comments and just picked one, and we said we're gonna react to this song. I'm sorry, we should have we should have remembered the name who suggested it, but this is the song that we're gonna to react to today. But guys, if you're new to the channel, hey, make sure to stick around to the end of the video. If you like our vibe, make sure to smash that subscribe button and the post notification bells because we drop videos every single day. Every single day, two to three videos every single day. And why would you not want to be a part of that and the best family on YouTube? So today, guys, we're listening to someone that I have honestly never heard in my entire life. Have you ever heard Who are we of listening? Bobby Caldwell? I have not. She's never heard of it either. And then, so, like I said, this is a complete shot in the dark. I have no idea what we're getting into. But let's go ahead and get right into this video. Again, we are listening to Bobby Caldwell, What You Won't Do For Love. Have no idea what genre this is about to be. Do you even know what, like, what is it? 70s, 80s, 90s? I have, I have no idea. Data said, please react to Bobby Caldwell, What You Won't Do For Love. And bam. Picked let's a random one, so let's get it. Oh, okay. A little jazz? It's smooth jazz, kind of. This may have been, it's older, you can tell. This may have been a good pick. <laughs> I've heard this. Just that first part. Oh! oh whoa! Hold up. I wasn't expecting him to be singing this. Like, I Baby, I, I've, I've heard that part just like you have. Where he's like, I guess you wonder yeah. where I've been. Yeah. Sorry, I can't sing, guys. <laughs> but I, I always thought it was... I'm sorry, guys. I always thought it was a black I, I was about to say the same thing. Yeah. I thought it was a black dude. And I like how they revealed it. I mean, obviously, they didn't reveal it that way what? on purpose. But like just him sitting in the dark and then come in and you see... It's kind of like really, that shock factor. Yeah, I, I really like that. What? Let's go. Yes! I never knew this was done by a white man. This is awesome. Piano. Okay. 
Damn. Golly. Guys. Shocked. <laughs> I am shook. Yeah. <laughs> Completely shook. I was not oh expecting it. And like I said, when it first came out, I- I've heard that little part somewhere before, like in a movie or something, but I've never heard the entire song. Have you heard the, f- the full song before? I-, I have heard the song, but like I think we are shook for the same reasons is that um, we definitely always talk about never judge a book by its cover. Never. Never judge a voice oh my by gosh. its cover, I- if that's even a saying, but... I always, I always thought it was a black man for years and years and years and years. I thought it was a black man because I guess maybe the genre, you know what and, I mean? And, this, and, and the, the soul. I mean, I don't, I don't want to say that because I mean, it doesn't matter what what race you are. Obviously, I mean, I mean you can you can have soul, and th- that this right there was was a prime example of, of it. Soul. I mean, prime example of of this man, this back. Mm-hmm. old soul and that right there it was awesome i loved every bit about that well i think for me like you know how you say you love piano uh-huh. i'm like i love trumpets and sax mm-hmm. like and i think of smooth jazz and so when i think of smooth jazz i just always thought that was more of a genre mm-hmm. for african americans you know and it's obviously it's not it's wide open and he just proved it to us like that was amazing i i definitely like i said coming into this i didn't know who bobby caldwell was but we do now <laughs> we, we definitely know now, but before this song, I had no idea who he was, or I had, I didn't know what to expect from him. But he definitely blew me out of the water. And you know, this goes back to you know what we've talked about so much on this channel. Back in the day, they didn't need all of the computer stuff to mess with the vocals, oh, or, his voice or, is or all of all of the extra stuff in the background. It was just solely on his voice. And there was some parts in the song where you know he said, "I let you know." Obviously, oh, I can't sing it. Oh, that part! Don't but, even but, try. But, but, but it's like you could hear like, <laughs> like the the raspiness coming out in the scene. Yeah. It was it was absolutely awesome. It was beautiful. Guys, make sure drop down, drop down. Give us some more Bobby Caldwell because I want to know is all of his music you know have that much soul in it? Because if it does, we definitely well, got to check more. And out. And then one thing is a genre that we haven't tackled is jazz. I don't think we haven't tackled I think, jazz. I don't think I've hit a jazz song no, yet. No, I love, I but, love wait, jazz. No, I think, uh, I think the the Righteous Brothers. Correct me if I'm wrong. I feel like the Righteous Brothers may have been a little bit of jazz. You didn't, I don't, yeah, I didn't you didn't. Jazz, so we I, we I may have know. to go back to that and introduce Amber to some Righteous Brothers. But guys, for that song, that is definitely an A plus. That is a song that it's a it's a vibe. Yeah. Like, like I said, that's. Yeah, it's just that, like, that's mm-hmm. like me and Amber on a date night in the convertible cruising down the road. Hey, that's the, <laughs> that's the type of song we gonna put on right yeah. there. Yeah. Um, okay, you guys know I always ask a question. So obviously this song was about like you making me do things for love that I never thought I'd do. Like mm-hmm. I love you that much. But at the end of it, the birdcage, what was the symbolism? Like you see the birdcage mm-hmm. on the bench? Yeah. Like what was the symbolism in that? Maybe you guys don't know. If you do know, drop yeah, down in the I don't, comments I don't and, know about and that kind one. of fill us in. But guys, again, if you are new to the channel and you like our vibe, you like our setup, make sure to smash that subscribe button. Come join the best family on YouTube. Whenever we say family, we mean you guys, our subscribers. And as we always send you guys out with, we love you, we appreciate you, we thank you, you are blessed, and we will see 